today but I cancelled it because one of the items that I'm meant to shoot hasn't gone here yet so today is just gonna be admin day kind of sort of some emails I tick off all of my to-do list if I get the time I want to film some outfits because the weather is so nice I have therapy today and I also have a short course I signed up for a short course for jewelry design so I'm excited to start that today I also uploaded my video yesterday and I was reading through all of the comments and thank you guys so so much for all the support and kind words I feel better <laughs> and yeah Okay guys, time to get ready. Although I am just working from home, I still like to get ready so I look more put together and it just kind of motivates me to be productive. We're gonna do a clean, no makeup makeup look. I already have sunscreen on. I'm gonna use the Typology Tinted Serum which is the sponsor of today's video. It is formulated with vitamin C, squalane and aloe vera just use my hands to blend this in whilst evening out my skin tone it is also taking care of my skin it is also silicone free so it doesn't clog your pores and considering that it's a skincare product it delivers this very natural light coverage next I go in with the typology serum concealer squeeze out a little bit on the back of my hand and using my fingers to warm the product up and apply it to my under eyes it is enriched with caffeine and niacinamide which helps with depuffing the eyes which you guys know i always get super puffy eyes and this on the long term it will reduce the appearance of dark circles blemishes and redness i'm also applying this around my nose and under my chin here so i have some acne scars for my brows i'm just putting on some brow gel and i'm going in with my brow pencil to fill in a few gaps i'm using the typology zero mascara which i find such a cool product because it gives existence to my lashes whilst providing some nutrients to my lashes so they are well protected and nourished and also just helps with lash growth i'm gonna put on some blush and lastly i'm gonna go in with the typology tinted lip oil it gives this supernatural gloss and it's not sticky at all can you guys believe that this is actually all skincare on my face? Thank you Typology for sponsoring today's video. I will leave a link in the description box for you guys with a little offer where orders over $40 you will also receive their Biface makeup remover that is infused with 1% pea peptides and castor oil. This offer will only be available for a week from today so do go and check it out. And once again, thank you Typology for sponsoring today's video. I have this package. These are all from China. There's an app called Taobao, which is basically an Amazon, but from China and it has literally everything that you can ask for. And I made some purchases and had a company to ship it to me. We have some new clothes. First, we have this hoodie. You see nothing really thin material, so it's perfect for spring and summer. I got these leggings that have this lace detailing here. This is meaty skirt. And then last but not least, we have this bodycon maxi dress. Then I got a lot of tea. These are Chinese tea that are supposed to be good for your body. You guys know that I'm in my health kick trying to keep my body nourished and stuff. So I got all of these are these help with puffiness because I bloat a lot. Um, and they are, yeah, they are supposed to like regulate your kidneys or something. I don't know. But yeah, they help with puffiness. We then have some poor cha, which is Chinese tea. More tea. I really hope this is not broken, but I got a tea set. Yay! Okay, I'll show you guys how to make tea with this thing. It's the coolest thing ever. Um, and it's so pretty, but yeah, um, I can't wait to have my friends over and like, Get them tea. It's in this beautiful jade green color. I have more clothes. Got a pair of baggy jeans in this acid wash color. 
these pair of gray suit pants. This is a long sleeve top that's off the shoulder like this. Oh, I'm excited for these. I've been wanting this pair of pants for a really long time. I've seen them on Xiaohongshu. Also kind of like yoga pants, but they have this ruffly detailing on the waist. Yay, cannot wait to style them. I think I'll make a reel today. Yay! Work time. It's so cold. My head hurts. <laughs> Everything is wrong with me. Um, I'm about to have therapy. So I just wanted to let you guys know that. I'll see you guys after therapy. Probably cry. <laughs> <laughs> I need to get out of the sofa very soon. I really don't want to. I'm so comfortable here. Oh. Anyways, um, it's a really sunny day out. Yeah, I need to think about what outfit to wear. It's really warm outside, so I'm really excited to wear something cute. I got some home fragrance. I really liked the design. Ooh, pretty. Okay, low key. I don't know why it's spread out like that. They should have made the the mouth of the jar smaller. I feel I can't talk today, guys. I just put the sticks in, and then five minutes later, I'll have to turn them around, and I'll make the most out of the product. I got two of them, and this one I want to put in my living room. I also want to get rid of these two artworks because I don't like them anymore and I want to find new art Put it over there I still need to work on this area of my flat I just keep on procrastinating Even this home fragrance, I got them over a month ago and they have just been, they have just been sitting in my flat for the longest time and I know consciously like, I see them I'm like, oh I need to put them like I need to unbox them and actually use them but then I just don't do it I'm like, I'll do it tomorrow <laughs> Anyways, look what just came in. Let's unbox this together. I already know what it is. So that is why I chose this outfit because I think it will look really cute. How cute. I'm obsessed. Thank you so, so much, Dior. This is today's outfit. This is from Martin. This is Dior. These are Calvin Klein jeans. And then ballet flats are also from Dior. It's so sunny outside. So happy. I'm thinking of getting an iMac, so just looking at it now. Do I need it? Do I need it? She's really pretty though. I'm at Tate, my friend just got here. <laughs> Eat this, no, 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 no
On the right is the kokonos, on the left side is the curling food, in the middle is homemade spicy pepper sauce. <laughs> I just came back from Pilates and that's all I've been doing these days like every morning I go to Pilates I come back I tidy up the flat and then I reply to emails and then <sighs> do content come back and roll in bed and that's all I've been doing and honestly I don't really mind it as in I'm kind of enjoying the stability but I do want to travel I also haven't been vlogging as much because every time I would pick up the camera I'm just like I don't know what to say so yeah anyways i want to read for a little bit i am currently reading this book lunch with the financial times and it's basically a collection of 50 interviews there are interviews with politicians with ceos for example there's elon musk here um with youtubers there's an interview with zoella and it's just been really really interesting not gonna lie i don't read all of it i'm just kind of selective i just go through and if i see a name that i'm interested in then i'll just read an interview and what is really cool though is like they go to a restaurant and they review i guess the food that they have at the certain restaurant and they even include the bill i'll show you guys um, they even include the bill of the restaurant that they went to like what they've ordered and stuff which i thought was really cool because you guys know that i love eating out and exploring new restaurants and so I've saved a lot of new restaurants from this book. Oh my god, there's an interview with Donald Trump. It's really gloomy outside. We had a great week of sunshine and now we're back to gloomy London. Um, I lit up my flat with the big lights, but it feels kind of weird. Um, let me see if I turn it off. Okay, I like this better, although it's still very dark. Whatever. You can't have everything in life, can you? Look! <laughs> I am going to a coffee meeting situation. It's currently 2.30. I have to be there at 4. But I thought I would walk there because I'm trying to slim down for the summer basically and getting my steps in peanuts there i wanted to share this sunscreen i have two that i like go between so basically i use the beauty of joseph one before makeup because it doesn't create texture like sometimes whenever i use this one or any other sunscreen and i try to blend in my foundation texture comes out and it's disgusting and i hate it and it just doesn't blend well but it doesn't happen with this one so highly recommend it has like this not velvet but like just a really nice finish and then on days where i don't wear foundation i use the la prairie one and there's a slight tint in this one so it kind of corrects your skin as well so that's great and i've been using this for a year now and i love it i've been so bad at vlogging i would do my makeup and talk to you guys and then tell you guys what i'm about to do and then i go on and do everything but not vlog it just being a really bad vlogger and i'm not gonna lie more and more i have the less desire to share my life with you guys and i think the main thing for me now is because i really want to focus on building relationships in real life whether that is friendships romantic rom relationships and more so like friendships and whenever i'm very on top of my vlogging game i don't socialize that is because i can't afford because whenever i do socialize in person i just cannot get myself to like edit and upload a vlog because i'll be scared of what the people that i meet in real life like start watching my content or, like if they stalk me and like they probably don't stalk me like i'm not that important but still the fact like knowing that people in my life watches my stuff scares me so much and i've always been like that i cannot have anyone watch my videos in front of me my greatest fear in life is to have to like watch 
people that I know watch my videos in front of me. Anyways, what, what, what was I going with this? And also like, I've been sharing my life on the internet for so long now and I feel like maybe it's also an age thing where I just want to keep my life private and just not be online as much but then like, it's just tricky because this is literally my job. Yeah, I just, I have a lot of internal work to do on myself which is why I'm going to therapy. I am two sessions in and to be honest, right now I'm still on the stage of therapy is a waste of money because I spent 200 pounds and we're still not into anything like we haven't done anything it's a process good things come with time that's what I'm trying to tell myself where's my sh oh, until I found something else to do other than vlogging because like currently this is the only thing I know to, to do then at the same time I just I also don't see myself not sharing my life on the internet I don't know how who I would be without this thing um, and I also wouldn't know what I would do with my life if I wasn't vlogging today Gucci is having a show in London um, I'm not going to the show but I am going to they're doing a screening tonight and I'm going with my premiere and then there's an after party hopefully I won't drink tonight I don't want to drink yeah drinking drinking brings a lot of consequences for me so I really have to pick my days to drink alcohol I wish I could handle it though because I do I do enjoy the buzz and like it really does loosen me up in social situations and I just become happier everything is just so much more fun and and rainbows and unicorns when I'm drunk I haven't seen my friend Mia in a really long time though, so I'm excited to see her. I also watched Challengers last week and I'm telling everyone to go watch it because it's actually so good. The whole, the, the watching experience is really nice and I, just, I love the way that they filmed it. I love the soundtrack. I love Zendaya. Go watch it. I was looking for a job and then I found a job. And now... Oh, how miserable. I don't know. My camera died, but this is today's outfit. It's 20 degrees outside, so I'm not gonna wear a coat. Let's go. Back home from my meeting, and I'm just doing some computer work. Also trying to edit a vlog for you guys. I need to take Hazel to the vet. She just hit puberty and she's all horny, if you know what I mean. I'm not sure if I should get her neutered or not because low-key, I want her to have babies. But at the same time, I'm not sure if I should. Show your face. Do you want to be neutered? <laughs> Anyways, it's currently... 1818 18. not sure if that's an angel number i what was i gonna do i didn't even did i vlog i did not vlog also loki i really don't want to go to that gucci party not really i'm just lazy but i am gonna go because k tornado is performing and i would kill to watch k tornado live the after party is at 10 30 so i have a few hours to kill anyways i'm gonna edit now hi okay this is what I'm wearing, just this top that I got on Vinted and then these jeans are Calvin Klein. I'm being really lazy with my outfit, but yeah. I'm gonna quickly touch up my makeup. So I'm going to my friend's place first and then we're gonna go to the party. Put on some earrings and some jewelry. I think I'll take this bag with me. I'm not gonna take this though, cause in case it gets messy. Pilates this morning and now I'm gonna make myself some brunch. I bought the salmon so I'm gonna do probably a baked salmon. 
I have this miso ginger dressing that I had for my salad takeaway. So I'm thinking of marinating the salmon with this. oven it goes I did not follow any recipe for this just eyeballed everything taste test last night was so fun I didn't plan on drinking but the music was so good that I I was like, maybe, maybe, maybe one drink. Um, I had two drinks. I had two gin and tonics. Okay, Tornado was amazing. I'm not hungover though, which is good. Not bad, you know. Not good, but not bad. <laughs> also, I hate eating the skin. I always pick it out. Not bad. Really not bad. And it's super easy to make. It's currently 12. I have therapy at 3, I have my jewelry design course at 5, and then I have dinner plans at 7. I'm currently watching this Chinese show called Xing Sheng. Not sure how that would be in English. It is unfortunately not on Netflix, but if you guys do find the source and like has English subtitles and stuff, do watch it because it's really good. I'm on the ninth episode. I think it's 10 episodes in total. It's a thriller slash mystery show um, and it's basically the story of this guy that is an imposter and has scammed people's money and then these people have gathered up to kind of tell their own story and that's where the story unfolds. I made myself some tea. I am writing down some notes or questions that I want to ask my therapist because I think this is better. Otherwise, I always just ramble on and waste the 50 minutes with my therapist. Like I want my sessions to be more efficient and productive, if you know what I mean. I have two more minutes until my session. Yeah. Actually, the analytical drawing stage, which we're going to be doing next week, and the reason I do this first on the drawing, I do this before we move into analytical drawing, with the, with the brains from last week. I also want to be able to see how you're progressing. Finished my class, and now I'm heading out for dinner. This is what I'm wearing. Why do I always have to like hum a song or like have a melody whenever I speak? It's kind of annoying. Anyways, um, yeah, this is the fit check. I feel like it looks better without the jacket, so I wanted to show you without the jacket. We're going to this restaurant called The Sea, and we're gonna have some seafood. Mm -hmm. 